Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to my Shazam movie review. I know I'm a couple days late. I've been late on these things. I'm going to try, I promise. Um, I got a couple more weeks of school, and I'm going to try to stay on top of it. I actually saw this movie Thursday opening night uh, about, how was it, four, four days ago? I saw it opening night. And uh, I had a blast with this movie, man. If I had to describe this movie in one word, that word would be magic. And I think that this movie is my new favorite DC movie. Yes, more than Wonder Woman. Um, this movie was uh, directed by David Sandberg. I'm not too familiar with his work. I know he did Annabelle Creation. Uh, it stars Zachary Levi as Shazam. Mark Strong is Dr. Savannah, I believe his name is, and Asher Angel. Um... And I really had a blast with this movie. Um, it was fun, and it's it's really clear that DC is doing a course correct, and I like the direction that they're going. They, not everything has to be all dark and and gloomy. I'm glad. I'm I'm you know I, I don't care what people say. I, I blame the entire DC EU debacle on uh, Zack Snyder. And now that they're not, this movie clearly takes place in the DCU, but it it. it it, it didn't hurt the story. They didn't go... Everything felt natural. They didn't go out of their way to try and drop all these hints in there. It, it just... It, it, it went with the with the feel and the tone of the movie. Um, if I had to uh, uh, rate this movie, uh, or uh, on the Star Strider scale, I guess, I'd, I'd give this movie an 81, which is slightly higher than Wonder Woman. Um, and, you know, this movie, I think it was kind of on the longer side, but I, I didn't feel that time. I had a blast watching this movie. It was fun. I can't wait to see another one. I hear another one's already in production. If you like the DC movies, definitely go see this. You're going to love it. I loved it. I, I want to see it again. I don't want to give too many spoilers. I know some people that are more diehard DC fans are upset because, oh, they should have saved this for that. All I knew about Shazam, I've always been a Marvel guy, so all I knew is that it's a kid who has these powers. Um, he turns into a superhero when he says the word Shazam. And that very concept, I think, is very unique, and it's awesome. Um, you know, we can go into the, ooh, Captain Marvel's that, but look, it's named Shazam. He's named Shazam. I, I, I don't care about that other stuff. Um, this movie, if you must know, I do think it was better than, a lot better than the Captain Marvel movie, the Marvel one. Uh... And yeah, I, I do want to go see it again. If there weren't so many other movies coming out, if I wasn't so busy, I probably would. Uh, but I, I definitely recommend you guys go see this. And um, yeah, it's an 81. I, and I probably will end up going to see it again uh, once before The Avengers comes out in about two and a half weeks. So anyways, uh, let me know what you guys thought. Uh, like and subscribe. Oh, you know what? No, before, before I go, let me say one thing. <laughs> I, I did have one problem, and that was the character inconsistency um, with the character of Shazam, because the, the kid who played Billy Batson, um, Asher Angel, he played him very, uh, very serious, and Shazam was all of a sudden very, very goofy. So I, I did think that was a little character inconsistency. Sorry, I just had to throw that in there. I, I needed to say that because it's true. Um, it, just, just, just a minor criticism, but I still really like the movie. Anyways. As I was saying, like and subscribe, leave comments below, and um, please subscribe. I'm, I'm trying to grow my channel. I feel like I'm stagnating a bit. I'm not, I'm not gaming as much, and I think a lot of that has to do with I'm not streaming as much. Most of my subscribers, I think, come from my game streams, although I, I just went through Far Cry, New Dawn, but, you know, whatever. It doesn't give me anything. Uh, anyways, uh, like and subscribe, and I will see you later. Okay, bye.